hey y'all welcome back to my channel it's your girl freezy curls and i'm back again with another youtube video so if you watched my last tutorial my last video i don't know if it was really a tutorial but i'm gonna call it a tutorial because i was still showing y'all how i do stuff so if you watched my last video <laughs> i showed you guys me cutting my hair into this cute little i guess like tapered type of shortcut i don't really know what it's called but it's cute it was time for a change you know it's a new year it's a new me you know i'm gonna say it every year because it's always gonna be a new year and a new me because i'm gonna always give y'all some new stuff in a new year so yeah but in that video i ended it with doing finger coils on my hair but i know a lot of the times when i do certain videos and i don't show you guys how i do a hairstyle or i don't already have that tutorial on my channel you guys asked for it so i was like i might as well just go ahead and show you guys how i do finger coils at least on the shortcut i have a couple videos already on my channel but my hair was at different lengths at that time so i'm showing you how i do it today on this length so if you want to see how i do my finger coils today on my shortcut go ahead and keep on watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video and I will see you in a few I ain't gonna lie I'm a little schmiz I'm a little driz all right All right, y'all, so I actually washed my hair like two days ago and I've just been sleeping, no, yesterday? Two days ago. Yesterday? One of them days I washed my hair and I'm surprised my hair is still wet because I slept last night with a shower cap on my hair. I think I washed my hair yesterday. I washed my hair yesterday, yes. And I slept with the shower cap on. My hair is still wet. I'm gonna wet it a little bit more just so I can get this protein treatment situated. So I'm actually gonna be taking one of my favorite protein treatments and doing a protein treatment on my hair. I'm using the Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula Deep Conditioning Protein Pack. I've used this in pretty much, uh, pretty much every video I've done a protein treatment in. And then after that, I'm just gonna go and re-deep condition my hair. And I say re-deep condition because in my last video, I deep conditioned my hair with this and it's only been one wash since that last video but after i do a protein treatment i really do like to deep condition my hair just to ensure that like all the curls is gonna be back popping again so yeah let me go ahead and uh wet my hair and then i'm gonna come back and just add the protein treatment and you guys will see the rest all right and just like that i'm back so my hair is wet obviously as you can see through the shirt so i'm just gonna do this real quick because i don't need to be wasting time showing all these little bit of steps so I'm just opening up that pack and the protein treatment. I really wanna focus it on my natural hair versus the color treated hair. Cause I don't know if you guys know, but your color treated hair and your actual natural hair has different porosities and things like that and densities and all that stuff. So you wanna make sure that you know why you're using certain things on your hair. So the protein treatment definitely helps with my actual natural hair, like my black hair. As far as the color treated hair, I don't really need to put like protein on it, but hey, it is what it is. Like if it just starts looking a little crazy, guess what we gonna do? We gonna cut it off. But let me just go ahead and add this. And I'm gonna let this sit on my hair for 10 to 20 minutes. And then I'm going to rinse it out. I'm taking all of the protein pack because we don't waste nothing around here. And just adding it to the rest. I'm not, I, I probably will actually leave this on for maybe like, 10 to 15 minutes not 20 since my hair still has color on the top and i don't want to like over process my hair with protein for that part of my hair like my color treated hair still curls up really 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 good it's really like the um the natural hair that doesn't curl up as much i mean it does but it's not as much so i'm not going to keep it on entirely long just to ensure that my curls will curl back up which i haven't had much trouble with it like if my if i curl up my hair it's gonna curl okay one thing about it one thing for sure is she's gonna curl but i just gotta make sure that you know it's still taken care of and healthy because we're on a healthy hair journey i'm just going to add my shower cap uh i don't think it said process under heat so i'm just gonna leave it on for like 10 15 minutes without heat all right so we finished with that Ooh, protein treatment is now rinsed out so we're about to go in with deep conditioner y'all already know the vibes if y'all don't y'all must not be subscribed so uh i'm gonna need y'all to go ahead and do that because if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed like at this point you're really fake i'm 
Okay, so I know it probably don't look no different than what it did before I did what I had to do. But now all I'm about to do is just take some of my oil mixture. I'm just going to add some oil to my hair. So this, this finger coil on my hair is going to be a little bit different than the last one because um, I'm using a different product. So with this product, all I'm going to do is just add oil to my hair. Since my hair is already wet, I'm just adding the oil now. I'm going to add a little bit more. And I do have my aloe vera spray. You already know the vibes. We don't use water around here. We use aloe vera juice. Okay, so now that all of the oil is added to my hair, all I'm about to do is kind of like section my hair so I can start working on the finger coils. So I'm just going to try to section the back and start coiling. I'll show you guys the product that I'm using and all that stuff and how I start the coils. But since you can't see much of the back, I'm going to probably do the back off camera, but I'm at least just start it so y'all can see what I'm doing. All right, so I have this section sectioned in the back. Just gonna spray a little aloe vera juice and we're gonna apply the product so of course i already did the oil so all i did after that was spray the aloe vera juice i'm gonna be using the main choice the alpha biotin infused styling gel actually my last finger coil this is the product that i use so if y'all liked how it turned out in my last video this is what i use so once i feel like it's all coated then that's when i begin twisting my hair up so i'm just gonna take a little little bit more just so there's enough product work on there and then I kind of start from the bottom just so I don't disturb any other curls. And I just take little pieces and just twirl my hair. It's literally not much to finger coiling. You just take a section of the hair that you're working with, twirl it around your finger, and that's how you do a finger coil. So that's literally all I'm going to be doing to my whole head. So this is technically a tutorial, but <laughs> it's really not that much to it. So... I'm going to be doing this to my entire head, but I just wanted to show you guys now because of course you're not going to be able to see the back of my head. So I'm just showing you, this is all I'm doing. I'm just taking a little section from the section that I'm already working on, twisting it around my fingers and letting the product do its do. All right, you guys, hopefully you can see the curl situation going on. But this is what my hair is looking like so far. So all I have is this little section at the top and I'm just gonna go ahead and finger coil it. So as y'all saw, all I did was add some oil to my damp hair. I probably re-wet the sections as I'm doing it. And then all I'm gonna do literally is just add this. This is a one product finger coil out. Yeah, I'm going to just show y'all what I do. And I'm going to come back to y'all in the morning after it's finished. Because, girl, I'm drunk. I'm tired. <laughs> My arms hurt. <laughs> I'm ready to be done with this. So, let me go ahead and finish what I'm doing. And then I'm going to come back to y'all tomorrow when I'm all cute and stuff. Okay? okay y'all this is me <laughs> after i finished coiling all of my hair so obviously it's still wet so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna go to bed so i'm gonna come back to y'all tomorrow when i'm all glammed up and my hair is dry and we can just get into the final looks so good night all right y'all so it is like two days later um i just didn't feel like doing it yesterday which i probably should have because i know i slept on it two nights in a row now and my hair is flat smushed all that good stuff but we're gonna we're gonna try to liven it up a little bit just so it can be like how it was in my last video so y'all can see how it really how it really get done so this is literally how i've been sleeping the past two days i literally had my body on so this is my hair 
it's still smushed but we're just going to try to lightly get the curls back stretched a little bit and i'm gonna pick it out a little bit too so all i'm gonna do is just add some oil you guys know you guys know the vibes okay this oil mixture is nothing new to y'all if it is you probably ain't subscribed <laughs> but i'm just going to take the oil and work it on my hair All right, and after I add my oil, it's a little crunch to it, but it's fine. Over time, um, the crunch goes away. So I'm just gonna take my pick and just lightly pick out my hair. And one thing I do notice about this product that I've used um, by the main choice it does flake now maybe it's because i didn't use it with other main choice products but as y'all saw when i did my hair i literally use my aloe vera juice and oil so i'm like if it still flakes with that with just that and that means it's just a flaky product on its own which i don't like that about it because i don't like any of my products to flake especially on like a hairstyle especially on not on like a fresh hairstyle but um it is what it is that's just what it do but there's not much else to the hairstyle except for just getting the curls to look as fluffy as i would like for them to and then i just go ahead and swoop up my edges i pin a little bit of the front down just to cover up my forehead because girl i got a big forehead and sometimes i don't want it to be you know the whole thing showing so i'm gonna go ahead and just fix it up to my liking and then i'm gonna come back with my final thoughts and wrap up this video okay so this is the final look with the edges all swooped and duped hairstyled and picked out to my liking so this is on day two hair like i mentioned earlier um not really mad at it it is okay that it's a little bit frizzier than it would have normally been had it been the next day but it's fine you know you just wanted to see the finger coils and how they come out and what i do and how i do them and it's how i do them and it's how they look so i really hope you guys like this video i just want to show you really quickly how i do them just in case y'all ask me questions and i'm not able to film a video because i have another hairstyle so yeah after this i'm going to be doing braids on my hair so if y'all want a tutorial just let me know that's what y'all want if not um y'all just gonna see my braids in the next video yeah so i just wanted to show you guys really quickly how i did my finger coils on my hair especially with this shortcut as y'all know if y'all watched my last tutorial i cut my hair myself into this shape it's giving very much sophisticated okay with this lip and the shirt and it's gold like yeah i'm about to go to a job interview and i'm about to get that shit period but yeah this is just how i've been wearing my hair lately it's definitely time for a change so you will be seeing a new hairstyle probably one of the next two times y'all see me on this channel but yeah y'all hope y'all like this video if you did go ahead and make sure you press that big old thumbs up down below also if you are not yet subscribed to my channel i don't really know why you be watching my videos and don't be subscribed because that's that's shady but you know you can go ahead and subscribe it's, it's always going to be there so go ahead and press that button subscribe for me if y'all have not yet followed me on all my socials please make sure y'all do that because i'm going to be dropping content on everything youtube tiktok twitter instagram all that so make sure y'all follow me but i thank y'all so much for watching this video i hope you liked it and i will see you guys in the next one bye